we are going to make it play probably this one right here. It's probably a basic one. Let's see. Yep. So if we hit play now, you can see that we can move around. I now have an attack button and that's it. Very simple. And this method applies to anything. It's just a matter of what animation you're putting on. So there's an attack button. Now we will add a, let's see. Secondary attack. You know, I'm just gonna rename it to skill attack. No. Unarmed. Skill. So unarmed attack, unarmed skill. Now unarmed skill, we're gonna have to recenter that to the other circle. There we go. And as well as change the size of it to 175. And probably change the evade one to 175. Okay, I'm gonna duplicate that again and put it under evade. Rename it evasion. Sure. And that's also going to be recentered there. All right, secondary skill. We're going to change the icon to that and evasion. We will change to something that kind of shows like you're light footed, want to evade. Let's see, that maybe a boot. All right, so. Unarmed skill, we will change the animation to something else that looks like more of a skill. Um, I know two-handed long has some pretty cool stuff. Tack four, maybe? Let's see. Yes, that's what I want. No, it's not, because it's unarmed. So, maybe go back to one-handed. Right hand. Attack two. Nope. Attack three. Nope. Attack four. That's too similar to attack one, isn't it? Almost. Um. Maybe not one handed. Maybe we'll go two handed. Attack one. Okay, no, not at all. All right, I'm just gonna do, I'm gonna go back to one-handed. I'll just do, maybe left hand actually. Yeah, we'll use that one. Unarmed skill, left hand attack two. Perfect, and evasion. We're not gonna play gesture, so we're gonna get rid of gesture. We're gonna add a new instruction and we're gonna type in dash. All right, and for the dash animation, oh, I don't think I have the one I want, but I think Basic Motions has one that I can use for now. Roll, land roll, there it is. Okay, so here's a very basic we got attack, a skill attack, and a roll. All very, very easy to put in. And if you want it to drain stamina, stuff like that, you just simply add it in the instruction, type in stats, and I'll show you all that later. But for now, we got these three. Perfectly what I want. Nice basic combat. All right. Now, let's see here. Got basic movement, basic combat. So, I'm pretty sure that's going to wrap up this video. Um, maybe in the next video we can touch down on some stats, health, stamina, implementing that into a UI as well. Maybe have stamina drain through rolling and using skills. But 
we'll we'll figure it out in the next one and yeah thanks for watching remember to show me some love give me some likes so i can keep on going